This year in January, Elon Musk's neuroscience startup Neuralink implanted a chip in a human brain for the first time. Here is the latest update. In a video streamed on X, formerly known as Twitter, the first Neuralink patient is seen using his mind to play online chess. The 29-year-old Noland Arbor got paralyzed below the shoulder after an unfortunate diving accident. In a video that has gone viral on social media, Noland is seen playing chess on his laptop and moving the cursor using Neuralink device. Yeah, so we started out with a few, trying out a few different things. Um, we basically went from what we call kind of differentiating like imagined movement versus um, attempted movement so a lot of what we started out with was attempting to move so i would attempt to move say my right hand left right forward and um, from there i think it just became intuitive for me to start imagining the cursor moving so how does this entire process work Neuralink's technology mainly works through an implant called Link. It's a device about the size of five stacked coins that is placed in a region of the brain that controls the intention to move through evasive surgery. The aim here is to enable human brains to communicate directly with computers. In other words, Neuralink wants to build direct communication channels between the brain and computers. Its initial goal is to enable people to control a computer cursor or keyboard using their thoughts alone. Interestingly, the startup, which last year won approval from U.S. regulators to test its brain implants in people, has grand ambitions. Its vision is to supercharge human capabilities. The startup aims to treat neurological disorders like ALS or Parkinson's, basically. Neuralink plans to help patients overcome a host of neurological conditions. In fact, in future, the firm could facilitate speedy surgical insertions of its chip devices to treat conditions like obesity, autism, depression, and schizophrenia. For all the latest news, download the Weon app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.